so we'll be installing Mac OS X 10.8.4 on a VMware virtual machine. You need to have VMware Workstation 10 installed and you also need to have the Mac OS X DMG file. Firstly, these are the file you will be needing. After you have installed VMware Workstation 10, go to unlock all in 10 windows right click on install cmd and run it as an administrator yeah this is what you should see second thing you need to do is convert the dmg file into iso file so you have to download this file open command prompt as an administrator and after doing this you have to run a code you should enter this command dmg to img dash i until here it press enter and it will run this you have to use your own path file name this is in my case second thing you need is this file I will give you the links. You will get the zip file. You need this darwin.iso. Another thing we have to do here is open this in 7-zip. In the Mac OS X install mountain lion content shared support, you will find this install esd.dmg. You have to extract it anywhere and then convert into install esd.iso. I named it Mac OS X setup 2.iso here with the help of dmg to img.exe. So we have done with that and let's start VMware workstation. File, new virtual machine, custom, next, next. I will install the operating system later. And just go next. You need to allow 2 GB or more RAM. And we are done here. Let's go to edit virtual machine settings. In this CD DVD, use ISO file and select the Mac OS X file number 2. We add it here. Okay. And let's start it. And we have successfully done it. Okay. It took some time, but now we are done. Let's start the setup process. You have to click on Disk Utility. Select this one right here. Click on Erase. We need this Mac OS Extended Journal. Click Erase. Ok, we are done here. Close the Disk Utility and we will go back. Select Reinstall OS X. Continue. Continue. Let's agree. So select the disk. It will take some time. So I will come back that time. So let's start with the installation. After you are done installation, we will install the VMware tools which will increase the performance of this version. So let me adjust these things and I will come back. The first thing we have to do is eject this DVD. So let's try it. 
object. Next, we want to install the VMware tools. Settings. Select the DVD option. Browse. Select Darwin.iso this time. OK. Right click here. Remove all devices, CD, DVD, and connect. Install VMware tools. Continue. And wait for it to install. It will reboot, and finally, you will get. Mac OS X running in VMware. So we finished installing VMware tools and we have restarted it. Now you can experience Mac in full resolution. You could click this full screen button and operate Mac as if it is installed actually on your computer. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed.